Hey, very good Wednesday to you. I'm CBS 5 meteorologist Matt Stevens, and here's what we're talking about today. It's mild today, and I think we end up well above average for this time of the year temperature-wise, especially on Thursday as well. We're going to be mild today as it is, even warmer coming up on Thursday, but it comes at a bit of a cost. We're into some showers as a result of a little cold front coming in, and that cold front is going to be the leading edge of a significant cool down through the rest of our seven-day forecast. A noticeable pattern change is heading in our direction. This afternoon, though, we're going on the mild side. Upper 50s to low 60s. We're breezy. We're mild. A mix of sun and clouds. Wind south at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Here's our seven-day forecast. 59 our high today. 48 degrees our mild low for tonight. Partly to mostly cloudy. An isolated shower or two around. Isolated morning shower tomorrow on Thursday. Better prospects of more numerous showers in the afternoon. Maybe even an isolated rumble of thunder tomorrow afternoon or tomorrow night. On Friday, breezy and turning cooler, 61 degrees early and midday, scattered showers likely, tapering for the afternoon, becoming isolated by late day Friday. On Saturday, breezy at 46 degrees, an isolated morning shower, more numerous showers by the afternoon, maybe a few wet snowflakes in there as well. Much better prospects of snow developing Saturday night, area-wide wet snow, blustery, then windy on Sunday as the area-wide snow winds down, then we're into some lake effect, localized snow and snow showers. Windy and cold are 31 only for a high feels like the teens when you factor in the wind chill on Sunday. On Monday, we've got our eyes peeled on a new system coming in. It looks like we'll be into some area-wide snow, potentially from what we call a southern slider system. We'll see how that plays out, but the point is we're watching the potential for area-wide snow Monday into early Tuesday with abnormally cool temperatures.